Yo, what is going on everyone? It is Memory here. We are back for some more Promise Neverland, this being the first episode of the second season or episode 13 overall, however you want to go. We are back. It's felt like a long time. Realistically though, I don't think it has been that long, like maybe a year or two, maybe more so closer to two years, but it doesn't matter. It, it's felt like a long time and we are back. Uh, obviously the end of the first season, we saw you know some of them escape and now we're out here like in the open world. So it's about to be crazy. And uh, joining me for the Promise Neverland, my attack on Titan Buddy. I think he said the same thing <laughs> at his end. He said the same thing. <laughs> so I'm just going to say up, it too. <laughs> yeah, Zypher's going to be joining me for Promise Neverland. It's going to be a blast. I think it's going to be a lot more you know, uh, enjoyable watching it with someone personally so um yeah. yeah i'm excited for more promise neverland we're gonna see i heard what we're still gonna have like with this season and even a little bit beyond it's still gonna be pretty good stuff but there's like mixed reception uh, about like the ending of the series uh, but we're, we're not there yet which i have heard and this is something i did want to bring up very briefly before we get started apparently there are going to be some like original scenes in this season so i'm looking forward to that and see like how people feel about that uh as well so we're here though, we're back. We're gonna hop into this episode, guys. Let's get into it. <laughs> oh my god, what the A game attack! <laughs> what That's the a terrifying fuck? game of tag. I don't know, Freedom looking kinda ugly right now. <laughs> right. Ooh, I like that first shot in OP. Phil! Phil! Yeah, this is better than AOT. You might have been trolling, but I I don't think you're trolling. Are we going to hey. see Norman at all in this season? I don't think we're going to see Norman at all. Dude, we don't know what the hell is out here. This is, I think that's going to be something cool about this season. Seeing what the hell is out here. Probably in their books. Oh, jeez, oh, bro. Man, come on, dude. I keep forgetting the motherfuckers like 11 or 12 or some shit, right? right. Or they... Yeah, they're they're all around that age. Oh, it's good to hear Ray. It's good to hear Ray again, man. Dude, I just hear yeah. Kilowatt's voice out yeah. there, dude. It's so good. So good to hear him again. Oh, Ray? For Norman. <laughs> He's like, this time, yeah. <laughs> For sure. See, these are all oh. things they have to think about now. Like, how are they going to survive out here? Like, the necessities. <laughs> William like, Minerva. Ray's like, you know what this shit is? <laughs> Hit this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be a pussy, dude. <laughs> this is that Minerva guy they're talking about who's, like, leading them to... That was the guy who was leaving shit in the books, like, the Morse code and all that. Touch me. Touch me. Okay. <laughs> oh, he's telling him to say poke it, so like... Uh -huh. It's that Minerva guy. Yo, how many of these kids making it out? I don't even want to think about that. Need help, come visit me. Oh, I miss Norman. And I miss Norman too. And he's not going to probably be around. Oh, well, they needed water, so there you go. Nice. All right, who's going to try first? How convenient. I ain't trying that shit first. This guy's oh, name is everywhere, bro. Promise Neverland. <laughs> yeah, this guy's everywhere. He's looking over all of them. Like, literally, in a way. Bill. Bill. Bill that's our guy. Oh, that's my goal right here. Oh, this man wielding a sword? <laughs> this is bad. This is very, this is very, 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 very bad. <laughs> oh, God. Another game of tag. Oh, never mind, oh never we're... Mind. Very, very <laughs> we're back to the game of tag. Uh, okay, so they're going to be back to this, I guess. Oh, that beautiful CG. But you just fall right through or whatever? Yes? Oh, not necessarily fall through. Like, you just won't this make it like out because it's yeah. tangled the fuck out of you. Yeah. He said, don't worry, I got this. I got this, Emma. Don't worry about it. I'm going to solo this shit. Solo zombies run? <laughs> Big zombie. Oh. What? Who just did that? Is, that? is that that thing with the sword? The one with the sword? That would be the only, yeah. That would be the only thing I could think of. They just want them for themselves? Well, no, I just think that, right. that monster is just like a wild ass creature. And like, so it doesn't benefit anybody. Right. So they just took him out. Oh, man. Depends out running these Right. <laughs> He's the tag master. Like, I'm not even going to question it. Damn, her ear is bleeding. I didn't even know if that was there before. 
Did Emma just fall? She just collapsed. Damn. I guess she was just trying to keep, play it off talk. like she. Yeah, yeah. Oh, um, this timing is not good. Who's this? Hello. Hey. A monster? <laughs> A demon? She's on the. She's on the visual. Yeah. Oh yeah, that is the girl. Oh, that is her from the visual. These guys suck at running, bro. <laughs> <He's> <laughs> just... Ray's smoking them, Loki. <laughs> Starting to get exhausted though, you can hear him. Oh. Who's this? Wait, someone just came in Minerva? and scooped him. Is that Minerva? No, I think Minerva's a human, isn't he? I think. Maybe there's good demons. That's what it seems like. So maybe that girl and this whoever this is are working together. Oh, Emma's here too. Or is this in the same spot? Oh yeah, it is. Oh yeah, they are together. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, she, she was about to be down bad. She thought she lost Norman and Ray. Must be good people. Yeah, they're really looking out for him. Yeah, Ray's like really like observing. He's like, he might be. Yeah, he's like. Yeah, that's, what you, that. yeah, that's what you yeah. question, yeah. Yeah, they're friendly. They're, they're, they're our allies. They still kind of like, I don't know about this. This is how you join a cult. Oh, they don't know Minerva. Ray realized they're demons or he, yeah. Oh, well, that's how he knew. Hey, what's up? What's good, homie? So this is Sanju, friendly demons. Ooh, the way that music came in. Ooh. They say they saved you, Emma. Why are you freaking out? I know they're demons, but like still, oh, they. Oh shit, that was fast. Yeah. Ooh, the CD. Dude, the CD is already better than AOT. <laughs> I like the style for it too. Let's Ooh. Go. Never Wait, Eve fast. wrote the lyrics. Sing it, Nate. Sing it, Nate. Come on. I don't know the lyrics yet, man. We actually have people out like, looking out for us, you know, even outside of the farm, like. Damn. Well, there That's we sweet. have it, ladies and gentlemen. Promise Never Lent is back after two years. I'm excited to see where this goes, where the outside world leaves us. They're like, you know, the author is like up, like she can really design anything she wants in terms of her world. Cause like, it's clearly not like with the world that, at least from as far as I can tell, not exactly the world that we know. Or maybe they're just so far out in this forest stuff that we don't, like maybe there yeah. is like a whole ass civilization we don't even know. There's, yeah, there's so much shit that, we probably haven't saw yet like out here like i mean they've been trapped they've been in this one bubble like essentially Since like the they farm were born right they've been on this farm like their whole lives essentially so now that they're out here like even though we're just in this forest right now or whatever like there's probably so much out there but it's yeah, like yeah. i guess it wasn't really a far-fetched like thing to think like we never probably really thought about it until like now obviously but like that there are friendly demons out there you know yeah. which that seems like how yeah. these two are which is gonna be and cool it, and then i also thought about like Maybe, like, as far as we can know in this, like, little bubble that we're in, maybe the demons really are not that dominating. Like, maybe, like, they dominate in this bubble, but, like, maybe there's, like, a hu huge, like, human civilization that exists. That With is just, weapons like, and prominent. who knows, who knows what, right? Like, what kind of there's technology. Like, there's, like, this demon or human war or some shit going on. I mean, because you see, like, with Minerva, like, I mean, we don't know shit really about him. We haven't saw him. We, we've, we just yeah. have got these things that he's left them like to help them apparently right but we don't know like i mean the kind of shit that he's doing i mean although morse code is kind of like old like an older concept or an older thing like it seems like a lot of the things that he's kind of leaving them i mean even that's you know thing we, yeah even that thing we saw with ray when he was like on that touching like the the that freaking hologram thing that came up or whatever and he's like touching yeah, it and yeah. shit like that shit's pretty advanced so who knows what else like what kind of technology just what else is out there i was gonna add on i wouldn't be surprised if like minerva is like a relative or something like to emma or i guess we, ray we know whose mother is that but like yeah. i mean like either norman or emma whenever norman comes back i don't know where the hell he's been yeah i'm not sure either i i like I feel like that could be a possibility. I just feel like what whoever this guy is, right? He's obviously trying to help the people from the farm. Not even probably their farm, but the, all the farms, right? He's trying to help free oh, yeah, all them. Multiple. Yeah, so he obviously has some kind of a history with the farms or he has like 
he's a, he's an important person, obviously, right? In in this all, and we don't even know what he looks like, or do we really don't know shit about him? So yeah, that's gonna be that's gonna be an interesting plot point going forward. But I feel like to open up this season, I, I feel like this is a pretty strong episode. I would say, um, you know, I wouldn't it's say it's, yeah, it's not anything like too crazy, but I, I feel like there were some some nice things in here that they had, and now this the this concept of there being like these friendly demons now that are going to be helping us most likely. I think it's going to be pretty cool. Uh, Cause we're going to probably, hopefully I would say, hopefully we grow attached maybe to someone on the Yo, demon side. You know, I'm already imagining like some shit like Sanju and Ray working together in a fight versus demons. Like that Sanju, would be, like, yeah, that Ray sounds dope. Or some shit. That sounds dope. Yeah. Yeah. If we got someone like Sanju fighting with us, like, I mean, damn, just from yeah. the look of him, like, and just what he's, he's wielding. Cool. Yeah. It's going to be interesting because if if the two of them are like these friendly demons, there's probably more out there, right? There's probably yeah. more demons that, that'll probably be working with us, which if you are in season one saying like you're thinking that, oh, we would eventually be work. If I told you we'd eventually be working with demons, like <laughs> you'd be like, what? Like, <laughs> hell no. I mean, we didn't we didn't even know. Like, I mean, I think what was the first occurrence of demons? It was like when Emma like found the body. In yeah, the car, found the right? yeah. yeah Connie or whatever with the. With the bunny or whatever, the Connie girl. Oh, the, oh yeah. yeah. She's like, hi, guys. Yeah. I'll catch you guys later. I'll miss you. Yeah. Nope. That <laughs> was our first encounter. And if you just see it, you just seeing some shit like that. And then you're just like, now we're teaming up with demons. You just would have never thought. But I mean, we do see this happen in series sometimes. Like, well, actually, a lot yeah. of times. Tokyo Ghoul. Yeah. Tokyo Ghoul, yeah. like, is a prime example. Like, the enemy is not really like. There's not, they're not Everybody, all enemies, you know? right? Yeah, you can't just write off the whole race. Exactly. All right, guys. So that about does it for my reaction to, or our reaction, I should say, uh, to the Promised Neverland, the first episode of the of the new season. Like I said, pretty strong start, I would say, and and I'm excited for more to see, you know, what we're gonna have as we go forward, as we're now out here in in the world, you know, essentially, like we're only in this force right now. There's probably a lot more out there. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace.